Installing your N router is both easy and fast using the Netgear Installation Assistant. Before continuing, note that earlier N router models may use Netgear Smart Wizard. Be sure to check the description below to confirm that this video will support your specific router model. If your router is not included in the description below, please watch our installation with Netgear Smart Wizard video instead. To begin the setup process, remove the power from your old router and disconnect the Ethernet cable from your modem. Unplug the power adapter and remove any backup batteries. Wait 10 seconds before returning the power to your modem. Use the included yellow Ethernet cable to connect your modem to your router. Plug one end into the modem and the other into the yellow Ethernet LAN port on the back of the router. Now plug your router into a power source. If no LEDs turn on, make sure to press the power button on the back of your router. Once the power LED turns orange, allow up to one minute for the router to boot up. Once your router is fully powered on, the power and internet LEDs will light solid green. You can now configure your router with either a wired device such as a laptop or wireless device such as a tablet. For a wireless connection, find the pre-configured network settings printed on the bottom or back of the router. These settings are unique to your router, so they do not need to be changed. To connect your device wirelessly, find the unique network name in the list of available Wi-Fi networks. Select it and enter your network key. Once connected, open a browser. Netgear Installation Assistant should automatically display. If it does not, open your internet browser and enter routerlogin.net in the address bar. When prompted, enter admin for the username and password for the password. Once the congratulations screen appears, select Take Me to the Internet. To ensure the best performance of your router, return to routerlogin.net, type in the username and password, and check for firmware updates by either selecting the notice at the top or navigating to Advanced, Administration, then Firmware Upgrade. You can select Check to find the latest firmware. After updates are installed and the router reboots, you may need to reconnect to the network. A good tip is to use the same Wi-Fi network name and key as your old router. That way, all of your existing Wi-Fi devices will automatically connect to your new network. To change your SSID and password, click the Wireless tab on the routerlogin.net basic page. Once you have updated your network settings, click Apply. After the settings have been applied, you will need to reconnect to your router using your new network login information. Your Netgear router is now set up and ready to power your network. Visit Netgear.com for additional setup details and the latest information on your router.